right, we are talking chicken. Everybody loves chicken. Uh, it's getting a lot of press these days, the poor been. chicken. It's not getting good press these days. Well, it's getting expensive press, but I feel like that's <laughs> everywhere. You know, I talked to my dad, and he's just been saying the same thing. Everything's so expensive. Everything yeah. is so expensive. Yeah. And so this week it is the chicken breast is on the TikTok, and it's blowing yes. up because a package of Chicken Supremes was $38. Right. Chicken is the sort of thing that I think we always leaned on um, if you were looking for a way to budget. And maybe that's the reason why, you know, everybody's freaking out, because if you can't rely on good old chicken... What do you got? I feel like they just go to the chicken breast because it's quick, it's easy, and yes. they feel like it's a good source of protein, which is fair. Yes. But you know what? You what? don't have to always eat the chicken breast. What? There are other things out there you can do. <laughs> There's you can buy the other parts chicken, of the you can buy chicken? The thighs. We can break down other things. Yeah. And if you have to use the chicken breast, yeah. we can stretch the chicken breast. How do we stretch the we chicken breast? We stretch the chicken breast. So we're going to do a demo, a kitchen little demo today with yeah. a recipe and a lesson at the same time. Okay, well, let's do so that. So I took one chicken supreme over here and I yeah. sliced it and made little medallions. And what I need you to do, Tracy, is bang them out. Okay. So just pull that over. Now, you can use, like, I use a bottle of olive oil at home. Okay. Okay. You can use a fry pan. You don't need a meat mallet. You get a rolling pin. Yeah, just like kind of tenderize okay? it a little bit. Yeah, that's perfect. That's good. So you've had a bad day at work. Kids are getting on your nerves. You yeah. come around. All you those bang things. out some chicken breast. And, you know, we're going to be making something with this in terms of stretching the breast. But do you want to talk a little bit about buying? Yes, definitely. So, listen, buying the grocery stores play all kinds of crazy games, right? There's yeah. different prices, and all the chicken stuff is always by the kilo. Right. So you have to watch out for that. So, what I do is I have a real simple recipe on how to get me to the price point. Okay. So, the kilo price you yeah. take, this is 27 or the, sorry, this one is $23 a kilo, basically, right? Okay. So, we just move the decimal point down, and we times it by two, because that will give us six-ounce portion. Okay. So, this is a club pack, so this was a little bit cheaper than the ones that were hitting the TikTok. This is $4.60 per six ounces or per portion. Uh, can we do better than that? What, what else should we be looking at? Same store. Yeah. Same shelf. Are you ready for this? This is the value pack. It's supposed to be added. They play in games with us is what they're doing. <laughs> this is a $12 package. But there was all kinds of different weights in there. There was one that was 600 grams. There was one that was 500 grams. Oh, I dug to the bottom. I was in there. You can see the bottom of my shoes. Yeah. I found one that had 950 grams, which is almost a kilo yeah. for the same price, $12. When you do the math on it, it works out to $2.40 for a six-ounce portion. Okay, so we're doing even better. Yes. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> And I'm so sorry, your pants smoking. The, the key here is that you, it's just twelve dollars for the package. So look for the heaviest package yeah. because you're not going by weight anymore. Okay, good, good lesson. Makes Next. zero sense to me if I own the grocery store, but that's what right? they're doing. So that, that's not already that. <laughs> then, like, like I said earlier, we can always go chicken legs or thighs. Thighs are the chef's dream. We right. love these things. They taste better. I'm sorry. They're Call fat, your they're mom and fatty. whine about it. These are yeah. tastier. They're better. This was a simple. $11.44 a kilo, which works out to $2.30 for six ounces. Okay, so we're really winning with the thigh. Right? The yeah. thigh is the way to go. And then, of course, we have the full bird, which is a bit of a hassle to break it down and do yeah. all your stuff. But if you're going to roast it whole, and you're going to do the whole thing and then make some stock and some other good stuff, you're looking at $2 a portion. You can go ahead and stick it in. Oh, yeah, plant your, in. You plant your little sunny there. Uh, there. There we go. So basically, yep, yeah, very good. We are learning... Try and get the, the package that's got the one price and just get the heaviest package. We're learning maybe get the whole chicken if you really want to save and you've got the time and you're going to use, you're going to use it for stock. You're going to use it for all of the things. All kinds of good stuff. Um, or maybe try not a chicken breast. Not maybe a chicken you try breast. a thigh. So you got to be a little versatile. You know, you yeah. can't go in with a game plan saying I'm going to buy this because just like romaine lettuce... Right. It happens to all the good ingredients. That's what they're doing to us, and that's what right. they're going to do. There's no reason for romaine to be that expensive at the end of the day. No. So what you do is you buy the iceberg, or, you know, you have to buy kale. Or you have to buy uh, kale. Cabbage, is not the cabbage. Is that what it's come <laughs> to? I like kale if you cut it really thin. You just got to stretch it out like a chicken so. breast trace. Okay, so we're so we're stretching out the breast by, yes. um, by what are you making? We're making a chicken piccata. Okay, let's do that. So is, the reason why it's, it makes sense is it's the thinner cut. Thinner cut. Yeah. It stretches it out. And at the same time, I've got kids at home. I give them a big portion. They eat a little nub of it. And then I find myself finishing it off. Yeah. Right? So if you break the chicken breast down, you can give them smaller portions. And if they feel like they want more, they can always come back. 
Love that. Same thing goes for beautiful Catherine. Sometimes she wants to eat a lot, sometimes she wants to eat a little. Yeah. So it's always about waste and control, right? Absolutely. Give them less and let them ask for more. I like that philosophy. It is a very good philosophy. Yeah. So, and this is also a great dish if you're cooking at home because it is super simple. The, when you slice it thin, it doesn't take nearly as long of time to cook. Very true. So once we get a little caramelization after a flour dusting, we go with a little bit of garlic. Mm -hmm. We sweat that out. And of course, do you know what the main ingredient is? What is it? Capers? Capers. I love capers. It's just the acidity. It's the beautiful stuff going in there. But it's the saltiness it's the of it all. Salt of what we're after, right? And Make Love something it. so simple like chicken breast that chefs really don't like cooking with into something delicious. <laughs> because, you know, let's be honest, it's not a chicken thigh. Right. So, you know, there's that. And then we're going to hit it with a little bit of stock and just bring that down. Yeah. And then the main ingredient, once that comes down by probably half, which is kind of getting there because we're quick. Yeah. Butter. Good old we, butter. You know, Tracy, as we learn, yeah. we need butter. You know, the chicken thighs wouldn't need as much because they got lots of flavor and fat. I don't know if I've said that yet, but anyways, that's you our feel. You might have mentioned that. Might have mentioned that. Six or seven so times. So then, all we need to do now is basically go to the plate with these, like, thin cutlets. Very you can see good. that butter is just coating the chicken supreme. Oh, my Butter Lord. Would, will fix almost everything, really. It really it's the does. Key. Right? And it gives you this sauce, and it gives you the kids, like, they feel like they've traveled to Europe or something like that. <laughs> and they're feeling very European. And then you just get this right at the table with the glaze. And you so go just so you top. know, this, all of this, the pile here, and there's more in the pan, is two breasts. No, okay. one, and a, one and a half. So we're looking at like one a, a $3.50 and fifty cent portion cost. Yeah. Hit it with the parsley. Now Ooh. be careful with those lemons because they're a dollar each. But then we hit okay. it with lemon as all well. Right. Yeah. And we're good to go. Oh my gosh. You're just so good at making everything look so chef -y. Oh, Like it just you. started out so pedestrian. And then look at what it is now. It's beautiful. Go to get that recipe online at CityLine.tv. So much great information. Thank you, Rand. Thanks, Trace.